Now, going over to the political part podcast, you have Trump posting an AI-generated picture of a cat saying Kamala hates me, and it goes viral. This after the allegations during the ABC debate, in which well, Trump versus ABC debate, and Kamala happened to be there as well, in which he said Haitians were coming to the country illegally and cooking up cats and eating them. Now, this is actually retweeted by Elon Musk on good old X Twitter. It looks like this was on Trump's Truth Social first. Or, no, it wasn't on uh, X Twitter. So it's an AI generated picture of a cat and it says, Kamala hates me. And Elon recently reposted with a laughy emoji. And that got 70.3 million views and 697,000 likes, which is obviously quite a few to say the least. And one of those viral things on X Twitter. Now, one of the first comments, again, comes from. Luke Zaliski, who's a famous leftist, or left, leftist Luke, is such a loser, Trump would obviously say. Now, Luke Zaliski is one of the top comments, getting 1,000 likes. He says, quote, Trump nearly destroyed America while he was in the White House, and he hasn't stopped trying to. He added $8 trillion to the debt. He lost 25 million jobs and proceeded over the most prolonged he lied about it, failed to lead through the worst public health crisis. Which, yeah, I don't think it's his fault that all those jobs are lost, considering, you know, China released that man-made virus. They did get 1,000 likes from Luke, though. Scrolling down more and more. You have Alex having a picture, another picture from Trump. It's Trump at a podium, and the sign says, cast for Trump, and it's cast all over around him. That got 2,000 likes. You have Demonology saying, uh, quote, believe cats. His cat has a little sign that says, meow too, getting 409 likes. Plan Means also has a picture of, yeah, it's a picture of Biden with a hat. It says Kamala sucks. Trump 2024 getting 2.4 thousand likes, which, character after they ousted him with that coup, he probably should be actually on Trump's side. Throwing down, you have Wall Street Silver saying PETA has been strangely silent through all this. Why? Getting 1.6 thousand likes. Well, probably because they're political hacks who actually don't care about the wellness of animals. Let's see here. Throwing down more and more. Jeez. AI, I want to say, yeah, I think it was just cartoon. Uh, so it's someone by the name of Conservative Alternative saying cooking with Kamala. And it's Kamala, and there's a little sign of Kamala that says cooking with Kamala, like a TV show. And there's a cat inside the giant uh, thing she's going to cook it, and then a duck sitting right next to it. That got 1.5 thousand likes. We also have Bronco Nation saying it's true. This AI generated picture of little kittens and ducks it says save the pet, save the pets, vote Trump. The ducks are holding, and the cat didn't, kittens are holding up a sign that says F. Kamala Harris, getting 764 likes. Oh, jeez. The Doge Glory has a picture of a cat talking into a microphone. It says, my friend Major Tom got eaten by a nation. Getting 288 likes. Oh, that's cute. So did the cat turd, little anime cat. So Ginny has a picture of cat turd, little cat, sitting on top of Trump's shoulder. It says, don't worry, buddy. I'll never let those Haitians eat you. Getting 269 likes. And granted, we're still waiting to see hard um, um, actual evidence of that. There's been some a lot of speculation. There's been one rogue video where they have a gentleman in a parking lot picking a cat apart. I don't, again, I'm still trying to see if there's any, geo um, any evidence of geo geographically where that's taking place to be confirmed as of this time. Uh, that did, again, that did get 269 likes. Someone by the name of Jay Patriot says, Who did this? National Cat Guard Army is ready. It's an AI generated video. Of cats in the military, they're dressed up in body armor. They got AR-15s, and they're obviously cute. That one is probably called Captain Mittens, probably. Now that also got one point four thousand likes. Going down more and more. Let's see. Bella has a picture of a Democrat-looking voter. It says bank ID, airport ID, doctor ID, pharmacy ID, school ID, gun store ID, hunting ID, fishing ID, daycare ID, hospital ID, bar ID, workplace ID, voting, nah. In 1.1 thousand likes. And yeah, great example of hypocrisy. Wow. America 357, in order to a very unique cartridge. One of an olden era, a forgotten time. Yeah, what Yoda says in Star Wars. Kidding, I know it's Obi-Wan Kenobi. But it's a picture of Kamal Harris, AI generated picture of Kamal Harris looking like a demon, basically, running, chasing after a cute little cat, getting 107 likes. Babylon, well, this is a Taz Tears, it says Babylon B, Taz Swift's cats, and Doris Trump, and his little kittens with the Trump hat, getting 368 likes. It's kind of funny, well, oh jeez. Uh, Truth Justice says Kamal's America is AI generated picture of Kamala. Holding a cat about to throw it into the kitchen. What do you call that? A cooking pot? 
got 716 likes. I just see if there's any contrarian comments here. A lot. Of, yeah, some of like some does cat lives matter. Eh, a lot of AI generated images. Not a lot of contrarian topics. Yeah, that's kind of cute. No, don't shred on me. It's a picture of, of the cat with a gasoline flag, famously. And it uh, says, don't snack on me. Getting 56 likes, which it would be interesting and hilarious if this is the one thing that puts Trump even more over the top when it comes to the upcoming election because the top things voters care about are cats up there. Could that be the one thing that unites all of America again as we've been so politically divisive the past couple decades? Maybe. But let me know in the comments. Do you think, again, this it's going viral all week. Do you think it's something that will you know really move the political needle in any way or culturally in any way? Let me know, because as always, it'd be fascinating to hear what you have to say. Thank you, everyone, for taking the time to tune in. Again, trying to get to 4,000 subscribers by the end of the month, so if you can click that button, I'd greatly appreciate it. Also, give me a thumbs up, thumbs down, or comment. is a great way to give me some additional feedback, letting me know how I can make the show better and better. Lastly, don't forget to take the time to tell your family, tell your friends, tell your coworkers, heck, tell your enemies, tell anyone and everyone. Just stay safe, fight the good fight.